Welcome to episode 34 of LearnAbird.Tech, where in five minutes or less, we promise you will learn something useful to master your technology. I bet you close your doors at night and probably even lock them. But what about on your router? Your router, if it has open doors, basically represent an open invitation for bad actors to wreak havoc on your internet connection, from creating security problems to privacy issues. So this week we found out from the nomotion.net blog that a significant number of routers on the internet have several of their doors open with no locks, so to speak, or with lock combos that are now published. So even though this episode has a nerd meter of about 8 out of 10, don't dismiss it just yet because it is actually quite easy for you to check if one of your doors has one of these very unsecured known combination locks. Steve Gibson is a well-known security expert in our industry and he has a podcast called Security Now and he's covering this in much greater and nerdier detail. But incidentally, he didn't even plug his own free service in today's podcast, and his free service is called Shields Up. Shields Up allows you to have GRC, his company, do the port knocking, so to speak, and to see if your router at your current location responds to any of the common ports out there. But for the specific problems reported by this new blog article, here are the ports that are found to be extremely vulnerable. 22. 49,152, 49,955, and 61,001. What you really want to see is this, that all of these reporting in stealth mode. For good measure, you might want to also choose all service ports, just in case you have other open ports. If you have anything at all that isn't showing up in green, you may have reasons to be concerned. And in a business environment, of course, there may be some legitimate open doors, so don't be too alarmed if you get some that aren't green for your business internet connection. Hopefully your favorite nerd can answer any questions that arise out of this and keep safe online. See you again next week.